What's going on everybody? John here with Wiki Game Guides with a Watch Dogs Xbox One versus PlayStation 4 graphics comparison video. Uh, this is a pretty short graphics comparison video uh, because I could barely tell a difference between the two. If you're looking for uh, some wild differences in graphical fidelity between the two systems, um, well, it's, you're not going to see it in this game. And this is a very interesting graphics comparison video to me because this is the first major, uh, real huge triple A um, cross platform title to come out on both next gen platforms. So I think a lot of people were looking this to this game to see, well, will it be easier for Ubisoft or EA or any of these other uh, major publishers to develop a game on one platform versus the other? And right now, I can't really see a difference. Uh, I finished the game on the Xbox One, and I have put a couple hours into the PlayStation 4 version, and the only difference I can tell between the two is that at the end of a mission, when all the skill points are popping up and progression checkpoints and all that kind of thing, and then sometimes achievements are popping up, the Xbox One version hangs quite a bit and really chugs, and the frame rate will drop to like 10 or so. Uh, for just a couple seconds when it's transitioning between finishing a mission and going into the free world, free roam uh, section of the game. Other than that, I cannot tell any difference at all between the two versions of this game. Um, so if you have both platforms, just get whichever one you think your friends are going to be on. I, there's really uh, very little difference between the two, and it's a great game. So if you're on the fence at all about getting it, uh, and, but if you're looking for something good to pick up for the rest of the summer, Definitely check it out. So thanks for watching. Game on.